I'm here at Parents Park today talking to Dean Austin about the new St Albans City Football Club Academy. So Dean, why is the club doing this? Well, I think it's something that um, has been we've been looking to do for quite a while. I've been chat chatting to Lawrence for quite a long time. But um, it's a, for me, it's a club that I'm very, very passionate about. It's the club that gave me my big opportunity many, many years ago in sort of 88, 89. And um, there's a lot of young, talented footballers in and around the area. And we want to try and um, develop aspiring young footballers. And why are we doing this now? Well, I think that one of the things that I've done over one of the things, many things that I've been doing over the last sort of eight or nine years is being involved in grassroots football. Um, I've seen a lot of good, young, talented footballers get to a certain age that decide that they want to play at a bit better level and then leave the St Albans area to perhaps jo uh, to join an EGA team somewhere else. So the opportunity was there for us now to be able to um, do something a bit different um, and try and get some real quality coaching and really good facilities to be able to work out of and ultimately try and um, try and develop some young footballers for St Albans City first thing. So what's the goal or, or the vision for the academy? Well the vision is is always, for me, I, I'm, I'm very big in developing and helping young talented people. Um, something that I've, that I've been involved in ever since I've been coaching back in 2003. Um, the vision really for this football club is to try within the next three to six years to get 50% of the players that are playing for St Albans City from the St Albans City local area. So what do you think will be different about the Saints Academy compared to other grassroots football clubs? Well, I think within grassroots football clubs you, you have many and there's some great people and some great clubs that, that do some great work. What we want to try and do is try and take the level a little bit more elite. So as St Albans City Football Club, as the biggest, the biggest non-league football club in Hertfordshire, we want to try and do things a little bit better to try and get it more to a more elite professional level. How we want to be different will be what we want to be able to offer the boys when they come in. We want to be able to offer them better coaching or good quality coaching, um, have sports science facilities, medical facilities, and then obviously we're going to have good facilities to be able to work out of, so good pitches to be able to play off, good training facilities, and that will help us develop our players. So when exactly is this all kicking off? Well, we have, um, there's really two existing teams really that have been playing in St Albans that will start this off this year, under 16s and under 18s. Both teams are still looking for a couple of players, not, not many players, because the, the teams are pretty well established now. Um, what we're looking to do is uh, from October time, There'll be, um, there'll be an under 13s and an under 14s PDP evening that will um, run on a Friday evening. Friday evening because it doesn't interfere so much with what grassroots teams are doing. We're not looking to, um, we're not lo looking to, to uh, take teams over or have whole, whole teams. This is going to be staffed. When this moves forward, the teams will be managed and coached by uh, individuals not by parents that's one of our one of our differences to what the local grassroots do um, they'll come in and train so we can take anything really you know we can take anything any number of boys where boys will come in the um, they'll come in and they'll be decked out fully in the St Albans City training kit and they will train across this year or across this season for the opportunity really to be selected for as it will be next year, the under 14s or the under 15 teams that will then come in to move us forward even more. And each year, each year we're going to look to grow it a little bit more. Each year, there'll be um, it will improve, and there'll be a few more staff, and, and we'll be doing different things. And we've got some great uh, relationships with people that are going to that are really going to help us evolve this. Sounds great. So, what are the outcomes that you're hoping for? Well, the outcome is, is that how quickly can we get um, lads from our youth teams into the St Albans City first team squad? That is, um, that's, be, that's what we're looking for. And also beyond that, 
Um, we, we want aspiring kids, we want to be part of their journey, we want them to be part of our journey as in regards that they aspire to play with St Albans City Football Club and if we can help them achieve more than that and be part of their journey then even better. Sounds fantastic. Thanks a lot, Dean. Thank you very much.